guys, so today I'm doing another awesome collab with my amazing friend, the Victorian K here on YouTube. I've been a fan of hers for a while now, and I just gotta say her tutorials are amazing, her dance covers are just on point, and she is just so amazing and flawless, and I love her. Um, but we decided to do a collab together, and we both love K-pop, and we both love cosplay. So we kind of meshed it together. Um, we wanted to do like really dramatic kind of like runway inspired K-pop ish inspired looks. Um, so I did this look for you today. Really dramatic, really fun, and I had a blast doing this collab. Definitely check out the Victorian K. Her link will be below. Also to the link to her video will be below. Check her out, subscribe, like, watch all her videos, you know, just go show her love. Um, she is so amazing, and hopefully I will get to meet her one day soon. Fingers crossed. Um, so yeah, I really hope you guys enjoyed this fun tutorial, and enjoy! Okay, so I'm going to start off with a primer, and I'm going to use my all-time favorite Mary Kay eyelid primer. And I'm going to apply that all over my lid and underneath as well. And I'm going to add a white base. You don't have to do this step, obviously, but I just, I feel that it makes the colors pop a lot more and they're more vibrant. So I'm going to use the Rimmel Scandalize um, Eyeshadow Stick in Witness White. Majority of today's look is going to be using the Sleek um, Ultra Matte Palette. And I'm going to start off with this matte white. I'm going to add it on the inner corner, the inner third of my lid, and then also as a brow highlight. to take a really light brown or you can use any transition color um, and I'm just going to use a little fluffy angled brush pointed brush and I'm going to create a new crease I'm going to take the crease from where my crease naturally is and bring it up to my eyebrow to go with the sleek palette again and I'm taking just a tiny bit of this matte yellow and I'm going to kind of blend it on the outer part of the new crease just so it kind of blends out a little bit easier but taking a mixture of this matte orange and the matte yellow I'm going to be adding it on the very center of my lid um, I'm mixing them together because I want kind of a peachy color and I'm actually going to use my finger to kind of add it on because I don't want super um, like a ton of pigmentation I just want a little bit this darker pink. There's a lighter pink in this right here. But I'm taking this darker more red tone pink and I'm going to add that on the outer portion of my lid. Um, I'm going to kind of round it out. I'm going to line my waterline and lash line with black. And I'm going to take a um, matte plum color and just blend it out blend out that um liner I just use my um, Lorac 2 palette the plum color to just blend it out and I'm also going to bring just the smallest amount up here uh, into my um, actual crease and now I'm going to add some liquid liner on the top I'm going to do a fairly decently thick line um, and wing it out 
All right, so I finished off the eyes, and I just used some mascara. I used my favorite mascara, um, the Voluminous Miss Manga Lash. And for lashes, I used the um, Oh My Lash Jojo Lashes, and I just basically took one whole lash and cut it in half and added it on the very edge. Now for the dramatic, fun, awesome part, you don't have to do this, you can go with this look. I think it would be really great for fall. And I'm going to be adding black tears. Um, so I'm just going to draw it on with my liquid liner. I'm going to take my black eyeliner and draw, kind of line my lips, overdraw them a little bit. And now on the lower lip, I'm going to be adding a OCC stain gloss and jealous and I'm just going to apply that on my bottom lip and that is the finished look I really hope you guys enjoyed this really fun tutorial um, like I said, you know, you don't have to do all the extra addedness. The eyes will be really great for fall. Um, so you can definitely do that. Um, definitely check out the Victorian K's channel. I'm going to have her link below. And she's amazing and awesome and just the sweetest person. And I just, I'm so happy to do this collab with her because I'm a huge fan of hers. So I'm really, really honored to do this collab with her. Um, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will talk to all of you later. Bye!